Well, I'll be darned. Friends, I have no idea what the, what the Wi-Fi is like out here, but I got a lot of work to do. And uh, I just thought to myself, you know what? I could sit at home and edit a video and hang around. Hey, Aaron, how are you doing? <sighs> do, do you guys know what I'm saying? Hey, Reese. Hi, friends. It's good to see you. I'm out on the farm here. We took a big tree down yesterday. Tell me how everything is. Let me know how, how, how's the, like, the Wi-Fi and stuff. I don't know what's going to happen. It could die at any moment. I'm out on the farm. Is it good? Because, good. Okay, well, friends, listen. When I start editing videos in the morning, I don't get done till like, now. Well, you guys know. You watch my channel. You see when it comes up. I'm just going to work. I thought I would just hang out, bring you guys. This will be our video today. Let's do it. I got a lot of work to do and Christmas is coming and this is dry wood and the weather is with us. It was a big dirty snag, friends. So I got a bunch of axes, some power saws. We got, uh, you guys will enjoy this video when it comes out. Whoa, hang on, just a minute. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, someone just super chatted. Who's the super chatter? It's, oh, it's Aaron the Viking Axeman. Hey, Aaron, thank you, buddy. As you can see, friends, she was a tight squeeze. Uh-huh. See that animal down there? All right. So anyways, friends, I'm just going to, this isn't hard splitting wood, but it's pretty good size. I got my pickup. It's nice and dry, the wood. I'm just going to hang with you guys. You guys can hang out together. Do whatever you want to do. I'm going to start swinging the axe around, throwing wood on the truck. I got my wood hooks. I'm going to split and just, just kind of go to town. I hope you're, I hope you're going to enjoy yourselves. Um, friends, I will ask one thing. As a community, if people super chat, if you see someone that super chats, we're going to be doing some giveaways, friends some merchandise and stuff. So, but if you see that, please thank the people that, that support the channel and support this community. Cause when they're supporting you, when they're supporting me, they're supporting this whole freaking thing. So let's do what we did when we started this, this channel. We thanked everybody for everything all at once. You, you know, you guys know what to do. You know what to do. I'm not even starting with my freaking shirt on because I know I'm going to start roasting here in a minute. Now friends, Check this out. Check this out. Stephen Letts, I love you, buddy. Thank you. Look at this. Okay. Nice green. Gareth, Robert Cup, good to see you. Matthew Sweeney, Christine, I love you. Jeremy, Matt, man. Always good to see you, buddy. So, friends, we're just gonna, there's cow patties everywhere. We're just gonna load up.
So what this is, friends, is, uh, oh, actually, I thought this was something different. You know what this is? This is the original. This is the thing that made this all happen. You want to see something? Check this out. Look at this. You see that? This is the this is the axe, friends, that got me going on the bullet. This is the one. <laughs> Look at. You see what I'm talking about? That's her. See the profile? Yeah. Can you guys see all right? Is everything okay? Hey, talk to me. Is everything good, friends? I'm just, this is how, this is my balance. This is, this is everything to me. This is what I feared not being able to ever do again back in 2006. This is where I thought I would never be able to do this again in my life when I got into that, when I got hammered by that tree. I thought it was over. This very activity right here it's mild right now I, I just I, i'm in such a good space right now friends i feel like i'm actually getting stronger i do i'm not joking you my, my remember oh never mind i'm not even gonna go there okay so hey bucking great to see you buddy donovan donovan nice to see you brother see all that white stuff you know what that is Oh, it's one of the best smells in the world. Dave, good to see you. Kevin Hall, Joe Reynas, my brother. Good to see you. Bonzo, Bonzo, yeah, brother. All good from Kentucky. William Klein. So I'm just going to keep rolling, friends. I was going to stack it, but I'm so close to home, so I'm not even going to bother. Friends, I'm not going to. There's no point. There's no point in me. Uh, sorry. There's no point in me. Here, let's get that necklace straight out there. There it is. There's no point in me stacking it in my truck when I'm so close to home. I can just load it loose, go home, poof, 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 right? This ax, I got a whole bunch of axes here, friends. This is a Whiskey River handle. This is one of the best, it was destroyed, friends. You see this? Look at how it's on an angle. Somebody hammered it and mushroomed it right out. I fixed it. That's the profile we want for splitting wood, friends. That is it, make no mistake. What does it look like? Looks like a bullet. Right? Of course it does. The only thing I may do is I may go up and protect that front we uh that front windshield there. I gotta try something, friends. I gotta show you something. Who remembers this axe? Who remembers this? Someone gave me this a long, long time ago. And I hafted it on a uh, home hardware handle. 
but I threw it on a C30, friends. It is a completely different tool now. Look at this is what you want for a split and axe. Right there. That's where you want that. One to two inches back is where you want that right there. See that balance? And you want that to sit straight. You don't want it to fall forward. I don't. I don't know what you want, but I don't. I don't want that. This, this axe is only about three and a quarter pound. We got knots. See that, friends? See this guy? Right there. But well, we can bust that knot. See? Look at that, friends. She's holding together. Boom. There it is. What a nice little tool. Look at that, friends. See, I'm trying to bust through that knot. Look at it.
You guys want to run some power saw pretty quick? We'll go down there and buck some wood. that see this friends see that great big knot you're best you're probably best to come here friends see down where the knot travels down low right there it, it'll go i'll get it either way but you're probably better to crack it in here somewhere to kick that that small piece off <laughs> See right there? There we go. Look at this one. See, these are, they're gonna get bad down there. They're big. Look at, I'll show you a little trick what I do when it comes to this. Gotta stack up that window pretty quick. Okay, where's this guy? Okay, you see this thing? This is a Jatoba handle from Jonesy, friends. This is a wood bullet. Okay, this this is it, friends. <clears throat> I want to make two, like five and a half, four and a half, and five and a half. The combos are beautiful in there. Look at. This was made by Brad. You see? You never get stuck. How many people, give me a heck yeah, who has been splitting firewood and having a hard time pulling their ax out of the wood once they get it stuck in the wood? Give me a heck yeah. Come on, don't fib. This is a beautiful ax right now, by the way, friends. Absolutely beautiful. Lightweight, nimble, very nimble. C30 handle. Glorious. Now, friends, when you get into this stuff here, this, this, look at that. That's, look at that. Nothing. Didn't do a thing. That's why I hit my, friends, I hit my, when I split my knots, I hit them down low. I take all this wood, because this wood is gonna be easier to split than hammering what I just did on the other side. It's totally up to you. It's totally up to you. Weather. whether you do this, right? <laughs> See how tough that is, friends? Could you imagine? But it's going. It's going. Look at this, though. That's a big knot, and they're getting big down there. So 
what I'm going to do with this stuff is probably go old school. Right? Beside the knot. See? But this is a problem, friends. This becomes a problem. So you get the power saw out is what you do. Yeah. You just get the power saw out. That's what I do. I'll put them over here. And we'll rip them later. Look at that animal out there. Look at this, friends. We're starting to get into the big limbs. Oh yeah. I don't know how excited I'm gonna get about this. Look at that. That starts to, you got to ask yourself, how important is that to you? I don't need this big axe right now. You guys remember this one this is jay daniel style axe but jay's was three jay's was three three and a half pounds this one's four and a half this is what me and brad are focusing on right now look at this look at that You know what else I brought today, friends? These are starting to get gnarly. It's not going to happen. That's a power saw show, that. Look at this, friends. They're all knots now. This is where it gets. Yeah, look. Friends, watch that axe jump out of the wood. Watch. It's just, this ain't gonna happen. Oh. Wow, look at that. So this is, I'm gonna show you guys this, this is actually funny. that that would just just break
I gotta go straighten out that. So check this out. There's no, there's no wedge in this. None. See, there's no wedge in it. Nothing. It's just hammered on, and it hasn't moved. It has not moved. We got a cow patty here. See how nice that is when it's straight grain, friends? Okay, I've got to, we should run a little saw, eh, friends? What do you guys think? You guys want to run some, some hot rod iron horse or what? What do you guys think? Keep splitting and loading? What I do got to do is I got to straighten out something here. You guys can come with me. I'm not, I'm not, uh, I'm not going to smash my window but I'm also not going to um, stack it all. Excuse me. Hi, Donovan. Hi, everybody. Good to see everybody. Paul Wright, season for elfin safety. Dao. Dao. Run saw. Oh, I see. Okay, some saw. Terry Hatton. How are you, Terry? Nice to see you. Nice to see you, buddy. This is too tight. Yeah. Good to see everybody. Chris, my little boy. Brody says, hi, brother. Hi, Brody. I'm from Sao Paulo, Brazil. Love it. Ruger farming, buck and blue saw. Yeah, I had the blue saw out. I can't tune it. I had to shut her down. It was too fat for my climate and I don't have the little square uh, thing. Hi, we're live. Um, I, I could run it. I could run it for sure. I'll, I'll, give it a, I'll give it a go. I changed the muffler on it. It seems better, but uh, no, it's Douglas fir, dry, dead. I got a video coming, friends, and we had to rig out limbs over the shed, and friends, it was a tight shot, as you can see, right beside the fence there, and there's an animal out there, see it? See that big animal out there? See? Pretty crazy. He's, she's just staring at me there. But I'm gonna get in and protect my window real quick, won't take a minute. Um, I think you guys are fine right where you are. Maybe I'll bring you in over here, just like this. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Let's do this. There. I'm just going to protect my window real quick. Are you heading out? Yeah. Okay. Um, so, and if you if you want to use the, the splitter, it's in the garage, but... I would hate to use that splitter. Uh, you what? I would hate to use that splitter. I know. <laughs> Thanks, Lise. So, all right. Okay. And, yeah, just uh, whenever you want to come back or how much you're heading. Yeah, if I got free rain, Absolutely. I'll just call you and let you know that I'm going to be in. Yep. Love you. See ya. Bye. Bye. So friends, that's uh, that's Lisa. She uh, 
She's amazing. She was my groundman yesterday, my ground woman. And she was actually absolutely scary good, friends. Like scary good. She was undoing knots. She was uh, rigging. It was crazy. I got it on video too. <laughs> it was deadly. Just deadly. So all I'm doing, friends, is I, I just want to protect this this window. So I just do one row, and it, and it doesn't. It, it can be messy. I'm not worried about it. It's just so I don't bounce one up and smash my window out. So I just do one row, kind of kind of half cracked. You know what I mean, friends? I'll put like sometimes I'll get a few up here like this and I'll go like this like this right you want it you want it coming up as level as possible friends right get down in here put that there maybe get a flat one like this yeah there's a good one put it in like this kind of thing you know like that and then you start adding weight to it like this see like that, friends. You know what I mean? Just because I, you know one's going to bounce. I only, I did it to my brother one time. He got really angry at me, and I don't blame him. I was kidding with him. I says, I'm going to smash your window, jokingly. And I smashed it. And here he was trying to pull me out of the bike. It was funny. Actually, very funny. But not to him. Not to him at all. He was actually quite angry. I was surprised he didn't hit me. He's only hit me once or twice, my brother. That's leather and steel. Okay? You guys know who I'm talking about. Now, that's going to stay there like that. Because we don't need much more here. We need to start creeping in. I'd like to have this a little higher here. There we go. This will come up like this. Then we'll get one like this I'd like this to work a little bit more maybe like that yeah there we go that's all I need just like that We go. See that, friends? That's it. That's good. That protects my window now. Now I can kind of go off a bit. I don't think I need really anything else here. That's not going to stay there anyway. So I'll leave that unless I did something here special, like maybe like this. Yeah, like that. And then like this. There, I like that better. Okay. We got poo everywhere. Look at that. Now... We just quickly get this like this because I'm not stacking everything, friends. I'm not. Okay, that's it. 
So that's how I protect, that's how I protect my window. It took me what, five minutes? Now it's done. Now, you guys wanna run some power saw? What do you wanna run? You guys wanna try that blue saw? It's up to you, we're running saws today. I got a little bit of battery, we're just gonna have some fun. Um, I will tell you this, the blue saw is not tuned. We have the ram horn, uh, iron horse ram horn. It's ready to rip snort right down there. We got the, uh, we got the Dolmar. Uh, again, the Dolmar is not tuned. I've said it three or four times. Thank you for the super chats. Who's the sawbuck man? Sinclair Sinclair. Nice buddy. Good to see you Sinclair. Thank you for the, for the super chat buddy. What a character. Thank you buddy. Shopcat, nice to see ya. Nah, what plywood? I don't have plywood. Nah, nah, it's, it's, it's a good idea if you think about it when you leave the house, but I, I, don't, I don't pack extra stuff to have to flip flop and fly. I just, away I go. I just about brought my sides today, friends. I just about brought my sides, but I'm close enough. Uh, let's just enjoy the moment, not think about how much better the guy on the video could be doing. He's not doing what you do. I, I get it, we all do things differently, but let's just enjoy the outdoors and pretend you can smell this beautiful smell instead of looking for ways to do things better. It's much more enjoyable if you put yourself how I feel with my lungs up and downing and animals looking at me behind me. Let's enjoy the moment, friends. I know you've got a better way that, to do it than I do in a way more efficient way. I know you do. We all do. Anyways, okay, I'm gonna, so what do you guys want? You guys want Iron Horse? Iron Horse, we'll, we'll run them all. But we, we're going to start. I got to scare that animal away anyway. <laughs> um, break in the Dalmar. The Dalmar is broke in. He ran the snot out of it. But let's give the Dalmar a go. That's a good call. Let's do it. I'm going to fire up the Dalmar. I'll grab my hard hat and we'll go for it. Okay, let's go, uh, let's go run this Dalmar. You guys can see what it, what it does right now. It's full house chain, it's sharp. It's just not super duper rocking and a rolling. It needs to be tuned, there's no doubt about it. Okay, but let, let's give it a go. Look at that animal, just sitting there staring at me. I love it. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna put my thing down there. Let's let's run this dolly, friends. Hi, bud. I'm gonna start on the low side so you guys can see what's going on. It's gonna get loud, buddy. <laughs> Kenzie built a nice power saw. <laughs> power saw right now who wants to learn a little bit about filing a power saw on the log we've obviously picked up some rock or some sand or something here you guys want to spend a few minutes and give this a light brush up a quick 
get back to cutting type filing that I do in the bush. Give me a heck yeah on that one. It'll take a few minutes, but it'll be quiet. We'll sit on the stump, hang out together. Are you guys in on that or what? You guys want to do this? I need to see feedback. Let's do it. I'm going to put you guys in close. I'll set you guys up. I got the tripod. Let's get this thing cutting. It's cutting like terribleness. Let's do it. I wish I had the tool. I'm kind of concerned about this animal here, friends, to be quite frank. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna put you guys here and I'm gonna I'm gonna go like this, okay? I'm just gonna sit like this and I'm gonna file the saw. Is that good enough for you guys? Talk to me. I mean I can show you down low, but let's let's not get too crazy. Let's uh let's do it. Oh yeah, hit the like button, friends. Oh, there's look at this $20 Rob Egan character. Rob Egan on a super chat. Thank you so much, Rob. We appreciate the heck out of you. That helps pay for the data. We got no Wi-Fi today. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Appreciate you. Let's click this. There we go. 100%. We just we just pounded you guys full. How's us how's the seating area? Nice? Thank the super chatters, friends, please. Okay, this is how we do this. This is it. Oh, I gotta get my glasses. Hang on. I sure hope I have glasses, because if I don't, this is gonna be a rough go. Yeah, I do. I got glasses. You guys in? I'm scared to turn my back on this animal. Okay, what I do, see my dogs, friends? I try and get those in a knot. This is a very, this is a good trick. Okay, we can't do it there, but what we can do, we're gonna be fine anyways, because it's a Dalmar. This is a brand new chain, friends. Okay, I just stay with, I don't push down, I don't do anything. I literally just stay with what they give you because all I'm after right now is my top, is my top plate and my cutting edge. Do you guys get me? Do you guys want to come right down in here and watch what happens? You saw how that was cutting, right? It was awful, completely awful. So I'm only concerned right now, you know what we could do? You know what I think I might do, friends? Bear with me here. This might this might be better. Let's get let's get cozy in here. Because I think if I do this, this will be better. I'll be able to see you guys and I'll be able to talk to you and read comments and see all the love. Yeah, let's do this. What do you guys think about this? I'm thinking we go for it. Let's do it. Let's get down low. Yeah. How, do, how does this work? Let's do it. Let me see. Hey, what about that? Hey, talk to me about that. That's pretty good. Mark, good to see you. Okay, friends, wrap around bar. See my elbows? See my elbows, my, my arms? It's literally like this. This is a brand new chain. I'm not, I'm not digging gullet, anything, nothing. I'm just going after my top plate and my working corner. That's it. Because if I start digging out gullet, that means I'm going to have to pull off some great big burr. And I don't want to do that. You guys keep your eye on that freaking cow behind me. He's coming after me. I'm going to show you. Look at. Look at this. Look at him there. I think he's crazy. See him? Is this gonna work? Yeah, that's all right. 
Okay, my chest is on the saw. I just want to get back cutting. I don't want to turn this into some huge affair. See, now I can see that cow. This is full house, friends. It's going to take a second or two. There we go. You watch the difference here when we're done this. Hey, I can see you guys. Joseph, how are you? Matt, man. He's making a move, that animal, isn't he? David, good to see you, buddy. David, Brent, super good to see everybody here. Look at these, Jay Stu. Yeah, I know, buddy, I know. This thing was cutting horrible. You guys saw it. As soon as your saw stops cutting, stop. Just stop. It's not worth it. You're gonna you're gonna get it hot, and you're gonna ruin your arms. You see, this is nice here. It's nice to have a little nub sitting right there, so you can put your dog in there. That cattle's kind of getting me goofy. If anybody knows the answers to questions that our people are answering, go ahead and answer them if they're realistic. I think that animal's coming in too close here for my liking now. What are you doing? Hey, what's happening? What are you doing? Yeah, I know. The closer your teeth are to the power head, the easier they are to file because the file don't, the power saw don't go bouncing around. Hope he doesn't come and rub his thorns up against my back. Horns. Friends, when you've got a brand new chain, you know what I mean? When it's brand new and you've, you've dusted it, he's gonna smash my truck. Hey. Don't smash that truck. Don't, don't be putting your horns into that truck, bud. And leave that ax alone. And that shirt. Hey. Hey. What are you doing in there, bud? How come? Why? What do you, why? What's the deal? Why would you do that? Come on out of there. Good boy. Good boy. Good animal. Good boy or girl, whatever you are. 
，哎。Okay, so like I said, friends, on a brand new chain, don't don't get too excited. You got to get back cutting. So just get that top plate sharp. And get it going straight. Establish your tooth. Train your chain. It's called training your chain. Okay. I do a lot of pulling. Look at look at my right hand. See my right hand? It's going like this. No, no joke. The closer you are with the wraparound bar, your wrist sits against the wrap bar, and just goes like this. I'm not joking, friends. Look, I'll just hold it with this hand. Look at it. It's all pulling. It's all pulling. Every last bit of it. Look at this. That's this side anyway. Okay. We're probably going to have to give the rakers just a teeny little tickle with a flat file. I'm going to pick up the pace here now. Because I want to get cotton. I'm just going after this top plate. I'm gonna bring you guys in now, okay? Let's do this. Let, let's, let's give you guys kind of an idea of what I'm doing on the chain, just for a minute. Okay? I wonder if that'll pick up the power saw there. Maybe right there. Does this, is this gonna work? I don't really know. Kinda looks like it's picked up the background there, doesn't it? I'll show you what I'm doing. Anyways, so is this where I'm at? See that? Did you see that burr come off of there? I'm not doing a ton, friends. Not every single tooth got smashed. That's why raker gauges are super, super important. See? This one's kind of ragged now. I'm just giving you an idea. That's all. We're not going to stay down here long. What's that animal doing down there? Okay. Let's see if we can, there we go. Sometimes a light touch is good too, friends. See this nice light touch? Okay, here we go. These have been these have been hammered, friends. Something got dirt. Could have been a nail. What's that animal doing back there? He's moving the log. Okay, that's enough for that. Let's get back now. Okay. Okay, friends? Always nice to stick that dog in somewhere there, like I said earlier. It holds the saw, see that? It's not really grabbing a lot. There we go. It's a nice little spot right there. Full house, so it's lots of filing. But once you get her,
Patty the Batty got a gift given to him for Christmas. If anybody saw that fight. You can get away with this type of filing pretty much once on a brand new chain. That's it. Because all I'm doing is grabbing the top tooth, the top plate. That's all I'm getting, the top and the working corner. They're all different. Every single one of them has been hit a little bit different. They're not all the same. It wasn't hammered or rocked badly, but it got shagged out pretty good. Like a dusting, you know what I mean, friends? We're getting there now, friends. So you'll notice this is our last tooth. We got one, yeah. Okay, there we go, now we go the other side. This file's toast. Listen to it. Oh, this is horrendous here. That Clay Walker concert was nuts, friends. Nuts. You can almost see a burr come off of this side. Listen to this, this is brutal. Wow, that's almost like one of them chains, one of those links that are hard, friends.
I know it's boring. I know. I'll pick up the pace. Never hurts to take a couple strokes down. Like that. What'll happen now? Is I will need to hit the rakers, but it'll probably do all right. This is why people use skip to. If it takes an hour, we probably lost 300 viewers. This file is done. Okay, so I've got a, uh, a raker gauge. So what I'm gonna do this year, friends, I talked about it already. I'm gonna get back into, into uh, round filing. I know how to square file now. And uh, look at this. this, this is just, you hear the file? It's not good. I think there's a couple of teeth here that are hard. There we go, I got through it. Did you hear that? See, now it's grinding. Now she's pulling. Very interesting. You ever get a hard tooth, friends, while you're filing along and all of a sudden it goes squeak? This file is toast. I probably got one in the pickup.
Yeah, I do. I got one here, friends. It's one of those intense cuts. There we go. Okay, I feel like we're at the end of it now. Yeah, we are. There is hard teeth here, friends, I can feel them. You get those once in a while. Look at this thing. Oh yeah, this, this. That wasn't good, that. I'm glad I got that one again. And this one. There we go. Okay, that is good enough. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna do. See my flat file? Watch this. One, 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 one. I'm putting my finger. You can almost tell by the size of the teeth, friends. That's it. You see how fast that was? Done. Let's cut. Okay, you guys are coming back now. Still 500 people here, I can't believe it. I freaking love you people. Seriously, friends, come on. 500 freaking people? <laughs> friends, Merry freaking Christmas, happy season, happy holidays to everybody. I love you, thank you for coming here. Let's fire up that Dalmar and give it a rip. I'm so glad you're all here. I can't believe it, 500 freaking people. Bent over a log, scrubbing on a power saw. You guys are sick. You know you are, right? In a good way. Let's get back at it. Dalmar, Kenzie's. Let's let's fire. Eep. Bang. Let's see what happens here. You guys, are you, are you guys ready? I think you are. Okay. Let's go. So watch what happens. You remember what I was doing there, right? It wasn't doing anything.
Don't pull on your saws when you get pinched, friends. You can see why I got pinched, right? See that? You don't pull on them. You rock them. If you pull, you'll break them out. Hi, Brooke. Is that Brooke? Brooke. Hi, Brooke. Don't forget to get the gullet. Hi, Brooke.
is the best. I like my Huskies.
interesting this saw and I'm gonna show it to you I'm gonna I'm gonna bring you in and show you what's going on here it's got a grind on it it's a bit ragged but it does have a grind on it but you know what the interesting thing about ground chain is you'll probably see the rakers will be shiny almost look at oh sorry friends see how high the rakers are can you see that from your view? See how high they are? Ground chain, you, you don't, especially full house, you don't want, you don't want a freaking, uh, a hungry raker. That there needs the rakers touched. It does, it needs the rakers touched just a little bit. Um, it's dirty, as you can see, we're in a freaking mud bath in here, friends. I should be running round file, really, in here, but, you like power saws? So listen, this is the most craziest muffler I've ever experienced in my life. Ever. You know what I'm thinking of doing, friends? Seriously? You wanna see something? You wanna see what happens when I give that little touch on the rakers? Just one little sweep with my, I should use a raker gauge, really. But we're gonna do a little bit more bucking. Uh, I'm gonna show you something. So, so right now, right now, it's kind of a, like a free, you've got a, a slight little uh, gain here. There's a gain, but you can go over the board, friends. Seriously, you can. You can go too far and it happens all the time and guys go, darn it, I went too far, right? So... I'm just gonna show you what happens. Listen to the power saw. Listen to what happens after I do this. Watch. Watch this. That's it. That's it. Right there. Watch this. You could notice it. It was kind of kicking back at me. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
guys hear the muffler? Can you hear me? Like it, it's still not cutting that great. It's not, I'm being honest. Can you hear the muffler? Like when I, I've got so much, it's on the pipe at all times, right through the range. This thing's crazy. Watch, if it was sharper, it would give you a better idea. <laughs> Okay, this saw is hungry, hand file, square, only about that much chain left, but it's really hungry, you'll notice it. to have your raker so this is a killer size wood for this saw let's have some fun check this out that's a harvey 266 watch what happens here
Enough of that. That's just enough. So, I, I wanted to, I wanted to experiment today, and show you that there's a saw for every ordeal. Uh, to, to be very honest, Harvey's big bore right there is not a good stand up and buck chain right now. It's not stand up and buck. You want to have them rakers so that saw slightly pulling you in. Not too hungry, especially in bit, like pretty good sized wood like that. That stuff's bone dry. That's going right in my woodshed. Um, does that make sense, friends? But when you're falling and making undercuts and, and, and back cuts in like three foot wood, full bar length wood, you do not want a hungry raker. You just don't. You want a stock chain. Sharper than, than stock, but I'm talking rakers in relationship, friends, Rakers is a big game. It is a big game. So, yeah. Is is that making any sense, friends, to you? Like the 66, the 66 was uh, was a good... And, and did you notice it was fat? I'm saving Harvey's fat out. Or Har Harvey's uh, saw. I got it fat. So I'm kind of saving it out right now. I love that power saw. And that is Morgan's muffler that we kind of made different you can hear it if i wick that saw up friends right now that 66 it turns into a complete animal and it, it's like crack crack it doesn't do that blubber the blubber is a good thing friends don't don't think it's not but the blubber should go away right when you hit the wood do you know what i mean that it should disappear right away um Actually, even before you hit, the, like, you know what I mean? I like it just whack right on the money. So I hope that's making sense. Uh, I'm going to do some more, excuse me. I'm going to do some more uh, firewood. If you guys want to hang around, you can. It's up to you guys. I'm just going to start splitting and loading again. Uh... But I wanted to run some software, you guys, and get women and children. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Does that work? Good. I hope you guys understand what I'm talking about here. And it's muddy. So my chain's only going to stay, like, sharp for so long. How's everybody doing? Hey? Everybody feeling good? Good. But we're, we're getting into some naughty, naughty wood. Is the Tin Man still here? <laughs> tin Man, I saw you in there earlier. Thank you to the Super Chatters, friends. Hey, we got more thumbs up than we do freaking people on the show. That's great. Cameron, it, lean, eat, cylinder. Yeah, when you're too lean, you will eat the cylinder, uh, especially if you get a little bit dull. So today's chains, uh, Harvey's Big Boar, 
I, even after I hit the rakers, friends, I'll bet you if I got my raker gauge out right now, I could still go down on that saw. I could still go down. It's not, a, it's not a good stand up and buck chain. It's a great stand up and buck saw, but it's not a great stand up and buck chain. Does that make sense? Do you understand where I'm going with this, friends? Because if your chain's not cutting good, we tend to dig our dogs in and start, you know, getting that saw to, to do its thing, right? Does that, has people experienced that? Have you folks experienced that? I hope so. So that's why it's, it, everything goes with the wood you're cutting. If you're in a great big, I just about brought my 94 out today, but I didn't. Uh, what did I bring? That thing, that thing, and those two huskies. Yeah. Uh, Harvey's freaking, I didn't bring any Tin Man sauce today, but I did bring my little Mac, but we all have seen that. The Dalmar is going to be nice when I can get a tuning screwdriver on it. Yeah. Wow. 500. Okay, so we got more thumbs up now. Wow. Oh my goodness gracious. Knud Simmons. Knud Simmons. Feel great today. Feeling great today. Good man, Knud. Good man, buddy. Good to see you. Thank you for the super chat. Friends, thank Knud. That's huge. Anyway. Yeah. Yeah. So it all depends. Everything is to do with the wood and where you're going. If you're like, I, I would run round file in here, really, to be honest with you. But I had a square ground on that Harvey saw. That Harvey saw, sure. Nice, friends. And that muffler is bonkers. Did you guys hear the muffler? Did you did you hear the, you know what I mean? Super chats are killing it. Thanks you. Thank everybody. Yes, thank you all so much. I I I disappeared there bucking, and so if, if you if you super chatted, thank you all so much. Thank you. Uh, no sweat right now, backwood. Not 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 bucking. No. No, but I will when I start splitting probably. And it is chilly right now, so I'm going to turn you guys around and start start going again here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay. Hope we got... Hope you guys got some jam going there. Now, what axe should we use here? I kind of want to try this little four pounder here again. So I, I cut that uh, I cut that knot, friends. When I when I went to grab Harvey saw, I bucked that I bucked that knot in half, just so you know. this look at what we're dealing with you think you're splitting that you're not splitting that you're just not it's not happening look at that friends oh can you guys see that
Each piece that goes into the truck is an hour of heat. I love it. Hour, half an hour. That's how I look at it, friends. Hey. Look at this, friend. Look at that. Double bit. This is getting crazy. That's just not gonna happen. It's not. It's a pickup work show now. Look at this. Look at this one, friends. Look at that. Hey, look at that knot. You see that? We just cracked that knot with a flick, right like that. We just popped that sucker right out of there. That's what we done. You know what I mean? Look at it. You see? You see what's happening? Now it's just finding its way. There's no, they're just too big. Look at that. Nope. Not a chance. Might be able to chip something here. Look at that.
Ah, ah, ah. 
I gotta show you something. <clears throat> Check this out. You guys remember this one? Remember this? When I built that thing? Are you guys still on? What have we got for people here? 415, okay, people are getting tired of watching me split, good. Remember this thing? 28 inch handle, skinny little. This is a wicked, wicked tool. Watch this. This thing is, it's mad for straight grain wood, mad. This thing's nuts. I love this little tool. Beautiful. Uh, so what this is, friends, is a dandy knob. And it's uh, beautiful for a chopping block axe. You know what I mean?
It's a chopping block axe. So, you know, friends, I learned this from Paul and always go for your crap. Always go in deep for all your crap first and work your way out of the crap. And that means that piece of wood down there. See that? It's way down there. Why leave it? Yeah, I could split here. Sure I could, but I gotta go get this. So should I go get it when I'm really tired or when I got energy? Probably when I got energy. Is what I'm thinking. Right? So just go get it. I just, right? See that? So this thing is, uh, this isn't the right axe for this. It's too low, it's too small, unless you've got a chopping block. Like, like this. This axe is perfect for this, friends. See this? This is where the 28 inch handle comes in handy, right here. You gotta work your way around them knots, you see? See that? Now we got a great big knot. See? Running right through there. Yeah, so if I hit here, like it's almost futile. It's almost futile. See? There, it's, I'm hammering that. It's not going. It's just not going. It's not gonna happen. Don't do it, is what I'm saying. Right? So, if all you got is an ax, you wanna go for the furthest part away from the knot. See, go, go, go way away. You see, there we go. Broken. I broke it. I win. There it is. Okay. So look at this. Is, look at this. This is very important information. This knot goes down. Okay. It grows down, you can see it, it bulges. The reason you take it here is because it's at the bottom of the freaking piece of wood and you can get it smaller. Now, now the only thing to do is split right dead center, if you can, or get out the power saw, or use it as a midnight uh, burner. There it goes, see? It shows its side and the way it went. All right, what, what do you do, right? There we go, I can handle that. That'll fit in my stove, that's why I chop. That's why I cut 12 inches, just because I can fit 16 or 17 in my stove, I don't bother cutting it like that. Right? This is what I like about a small axe. You can get it back up over your head quickly, like this. But you can't do that with a big axe. So bring, bring, you know, bring a few axes with you. Don't take one. That's gonna be a power saw show, no doubt about it. Oh yeah.
to explain something to you. You're going to, if you reach over with a hungry chain, if you reach over, can you guys see me? Okay, this is, this is power saw. This is sawmanship. Watch what I'm talking about here. Watch. If you reach over, we're not splitting this. We're not splitting it. There's a big knot. If you, like that one here, friends, you see it? I flicked it there once. Did you see that? I flicked it. Watch what I'm talking about. It's that's why it's always nice to have a long bar and learn your tip. Understand your tip, what it's going to do when it's hungry and what it's going to do when it's not so hungry. Right, friends, you get me? I just like to show people that. Like here's another one. You try and rip that. We don't have to, but if you try and rip it, if you flick your if you flick your power saw tip over like this, I'll show you. I'm just gonna freaking show you. I'm not even gonna watch what I'm talking about. If you go like this and try and, and, try and rip something. careful when you're doing that with your tip i'm friends this is no joke i've seen it happen to people this is what can happen you can go like this with your chain especially if it's hungry you have your foot down there and this freaking thing will turn and you'll cut yourself friends i'm, I'm serious be very careful with these little techniques that you see people doing be very careful with them Learn your tip. Okay. I hope this is helping out, friends. I really do, you know. Gosh darn it, I do.
Anybody recognize this?
What's that? I'm Carl. How you doing? Yeah. Yeah. What? Just finish it up. Yeah. It's a beautiful wood. Gorgeous. Yeah. It's got nice tight frame. Oh no, it's not tight. No. No, no, no. Nice and open grown then. No, it's loose. Oh yeah. Very young. Yeah. Okay. Young for its. Uh, oh man. But it's dry. Yeah. That's the main thing. Oh, it's been standing around dry. I didn't even know there was one out there. Holy it was shit. dead, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Holy shit. Beauty. <laughs> There's a few dead trees around here, isn't there? The balsams are dying in the cedars, yeah. but the firs don't they, they don't I see. mean those, those are those are fur, but them balsams are dying. See them over there? Yeah. Oh, They're yeah. gonna die. Yeah, oh for sure. Oh that's a nice set of docks. Yeah. Let me check. Doing some photography, eh? You are? You are. Oh, I'm filming right now, yeah. actually. Yeah. Then I'm in your way. <laughs> Not my way at all. Oh, well, you don't mind being on YouTube? Oh, shit, no. No problem at all. Yeah. Oh, man. Holy cow. So where are they? There they are. That's what I want to see. Okay. That animal? Are you picking up that animal? No, 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 no. Oh. Actually, no. The Oh, that reminds me. Um, Hadrian is gone. Yeah, there was another big one, 800 pounder. Yeah, yeah, that's right. He was here. He was a monster, that guy. Well, this one is 400 pounds more. This one here. They're interesting. Yeah. They're Scottish, eh? Yeah, 1,200 pounds of hot steaming meatloaf there. Is that right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, apparently. Yeah. Yeah. You don't want to mess around with them. What was your first name? Charles. Charles, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go see if I can. Okay, get... uh, thanks for stopping by. Yeah. Oh, well, interesting to see what's going on. Yeah. Nice to see you. Nice seeing you. Did you see that last flick there, friends? That thing was, it was going every which way but loose. By the way, friends, just so you know, this wood can go right in my stove. Right, right in. I don't know if we're gonna get this one, friends, like this. We're not, actually. We're not going to, no. There's a huge knot right there, massive. And what I could do, absolutely I could. I could go like this. See this? We just opened that up. Now, I have the chance like that and make it smaller which I just done you seen that right friends see how I flick when I hit it so the axe goes out and splays away we're done here friends What's this? Okay. What about this? That one's pretty snotty. Let's see. All this bark around here. Oof. Thud. There we go. That's that. Isn't that beautiful? Ching.
Friends, I feel strong today. I have been for the last few days. I had a shoulder thing go on there a while back. But when I'm feeling like I'm feeling right now, it tells me something. It tells me that I can actually get stronger than I am now. Still recovering from that horrible accident in 06. It tells me that I can actually get stronger still. Right? Right, friends? There's no sense in lying down. Don't lie down. Don't do it. If you want to if you want to tell yourself that you're finished and and that that you want to hold on to your victim, be a victim. Go for it. That'll be what you'll be doing. You'll you'll justify your yourself and you'll hold on to your victimus your victimism a lot of people hold on to it they convict to that victim i'm convicted to being a victim my childhood was bad my accident was bad this this i'm a victim i'm not gonna no 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 don't think for a second the the old universe don't pick up on what you're putting down because it does i've experienced it okay Now we got a little bit of water on top of the brow. That was good. This is what we're looking for here, friends. This is what this is what we need. This is how we get grounded. This is how we get grounded. Okay, we got 506 people. Okay. Look at friends. Get the gullet. Right? Hey, hey, who's that? Is that Jade? Oh no, it's Zeth. Zeth with a $50 super freaking chat. What a guy. Thank you, Zeth. Don't forget to get your rakers, friends. Don't forget. All right. Okay. Hey, <laughs> it's good to see you, everybody. I'm glad you came. We got 664. Uh, thumbs up. Fat man. Hey, Bucking, how you doing? Ben. What does gullet mean? The gullet is the bottom part of the chain on your power saw chain, the bottom part. You got to get the gullet. That first, so did you guys see the Dolmar cut after I filed it, friends? It was not cutting anything. And it that was a quick, just whip them up, get it going. The next filing, the next filing will be probably pretty, pretty whip snappity, that next one. Laura, Laura Krug, nice to see you. It's fur, Jay Daniels, 100%. It's, it's Doug fur and it is bone dry. Let's go for a little stroll, friends, and then I'll say goodbye. Look it. It's fur and it's been dead. I climbed the, whoa, what the heck's going on? I climbed, hey, wait. I climbed this thing. Oh my goodness, that's my power saw, bud. That's my power saw. Mind if I grab that? You'll cut your nose on that, bud. Good man. Yeah, good boy. How about I get this? How about I get this and you stay out there? Okay? See the rack? See, friends? That's what I'm talking about. Bone dry all the way up. You see? Say goodbye to this character. That, that animal's huge. He, 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 huge. Hey, what is that? Oh, it's poo-poo. Okay. So, so this thing was standing dead. The bark was falling off it. I climbed. Look at that. There's a perfect example right there. That's going in my shed. All of it. Every bit of it's going in my shed. Look at friends. That's halfway up the tree. Look at that. <laughs> we'll come back and get that another day. Look at this wood. Look at. So, so that's why I'm not stacking it friends because I'm so close to home. I'll jump on that sucker. I'll jump on that bull right now, grab him by the ears and just go. You want to see something funny? I'll come running up behind him and jump on him and just go. And then you'll then then that's bucking. That's called bucking, right? Hey, I got so much poop on my boots. It's unbelievable. Okay, let's get square here. So, excuse me, excuse me for the snorts. Hey, friends. So. Do you guys get the, the chain thing? Hi, Wendy. Chip. 
Hey, Chip R10, good to see you, buddy. Turbo T. Okay, friends. I'm gonna get gather up my goodies. Listen. Work hard, be honest, and be kind. I don't know what's here for super chats. I didn't, I was working as you saw. We're gonna take today's super chats. We're gonna take, oh my goodness, there's one right there. Thank you for the super chat. Who was that character? We're giving super chats away. Friends, it's Monty Brown. Love your vibe. Thank you for doing what you do. You're very welcome, my friend. I wouldn't be doing anything else whether I had the camera turned on or not. This is my life, brother. This is what I do. Now, whoa, what's he? Oh, look at him. He's crazy. He's itching himself on it. Look. Hey, friends, there was another super chat here from a gentleman. I, okay, I don't know what's happening here. Oh, it's Sheps. Shep, wrist flick on point today, bucking. Yeah, not bad, eh, buddy? Thanks for the super chat, pal. Appreciate you. Sheps, good man. And then, of course, we had uh, Zeth. Zeth is a wild man and he, oh dear, here comes that animal. I got to get moving, friends. He's coming in for the kill. I got to go. I got to gather up my goodies. Okay, you don't want that. Here, let, let me take that for you. Come on now. Big growth on him or something or a hip bone or whatever the heck that is there. See, he's going in there to rub himself. Okay. You, you don't, you don't want to, you just, you got to watch these suckers. You don't want to turn your back on them. You never know. They're pretty peaceful, but. I would hate to get walloped by him. Anyways, friends, thank you to the Super Chatters. Thank you for being here. There's still 400 and something people. I'm leaving. I love you. This wood is bone dry. We've worked here for years on this property. What I was going to say is I'm going through the Super Chats when I get home. Okay? Everybody that Super Chatted, I'm going through the Super Chats. We're going to take YouTube's little piece that they take off. We're taking that off. And then we're giving it to the homeless shelter for Christmas. You know what I was thinking of doing, friends? And I hesitate doing this because I don't like watching videos where people go walking downtown and hand money out. But I thought about taking 10 $100 bills and going walking downtown Nanaimo and having Rita come with me and film me and just start throwing $100 bills at homeless people <clears throat> just for something to do. But I don't like doing that because it looks like you're, you're boasting and braggadocious about it. And I don't like that part of it. So I'm not sure. I'll, I'll think about it. I'll need your feedback from you guys. I, I don't like doing that kind of thing, but it is pretty nice to do. I think I'll just do it anyways. But you guys don't want to see that film, do you? No, of course not. You know me. Okay, we got to go. Over and out. Love yous. Who else? Super chatters? Moderators. Thank you for all your help. Catch you on the next one. I got some good content coming your way, friends. Hey, buddy, hit the road. That's... No. Okay, I've had enough of this. I'm okay, off you go. I gotta I gotta gear up. You you just carry on. Okay, come on. Off you go. Good boy. I gotta pick up my goodies. Where you go. There you go. Oh, back out there. Come on. Where you go. Good, good girl. Good girl. Very good. A peaceful creature. <laughs> Love you. Be kind, friends. Help some folks out starting now.